Bob's lasting legacy is that he worked with a group of people in order to put science, technology, and engineering on the front lines in California. I think the key thing that Bob did was take a fairly small department that had been off to a good start and make it into a great department. 1992-93, when I was thinking of coming, in U.S. News & World Report, the division was ranked 44. And when I left, we were 10 or 11 in nine years. You cannot do that without fabulous people, a great team, wonderful faculty, who are now walking, talking, and looking like a great school of engineering. Working with a group of politicians, industry people, and academics, Bob's efforts led to the California Institutes for Science and Innovation, that led to CalIT2, that led to the Governor's Initiative, a special investment in building up more engineering faculty in California. Bob approached me one day about the possibility of a significant donation to the School of Engineering to be able to allow it to bring in more students, to have preparation for new faculty, provide some support for them when they arrived on campus, and that perhaps a way of doing that was to provide a naming gift for the school. And everybody knows Jacob School means excellence in engineering, but you need a brand. Everybody's got a college or school of engineering. What's differentiating at UC San Diego? Well, having an endowment is differentiating. Having a name is differentiating. And we were the first named school of engineering in the UC system. Bob brought great expertise and confidence in taking the school to the next level. And I think that we can give great credit to him for the success of the engineering school today. Bob was a master at identifying great talent and good work. He had the ability to recruit over 60 faculty who were great in themselves and could do important things. And he brought them to the school. That's the legacy, that's the DNA of the school. Even till today, he exercises both those skills. He's at the Cavalry Foundation, and he's still picking great ideas and great people to get it done. And that legacy continues. And if you're focused on basic science and you know what you're doing and you've got a strategy and you use the resources wisely, you can have an enormous impact. Cavalry had that capability. I could see it. It's going to be, I'm convinced, a very powerful element of how the United States stays strong in science through the next decade or two. The entire state has benefited from Bob's vision of engineering as a force for the public good. If you get a great team behind a strong vision, you can get an extraordinary outcome. And I think that's what happened here. But it did not happen because of me. It happened because of all the people at UC San Diego who were on this train that moved the train way, way, way down the tracks.